to a final event on the track. And this man here, Noel Isles, well, he's asked yesterday, he said, well, if the crowd are in for it, up for it, if they give me the energy, then let's see what I can do. Similar talk to that which we heard from Jackson. Jackson was a little off it, but she certainly went for it. You can't say that she didn't. So what can Noel Isles do? DeGrasse is back for more after the 100 metres a little earlier on, the Olympic champion at this distance. The silver medalist behind the grass last year, Kenny Benderek from the USA, and second in Eugene as well at the world champs. Noel Isles, the world champion, roars to the crowd as if to say, come on, come with me, help me run quick here. New American record, 19.31, eclipsing the great Michael Johnson finally. And Knighton, this teenager who come continues to impress seven times under 20 seconds this year that is remarkable the world junior record holder from earlier this year Ogando can run 400s as well what a year he has improved hugely from 20.54 to under 20 seconds Jareem Richards another 400 200 specialist Commonwealth champion at this distance Aaron Brown of Canada, again, we saw in the 100 metres earlier, and then Desalu, part of the Italian Olympic relay team that won the gold medal last year. So Lyles will be in six, Knighton in five, Orgando, Richards, watch out for him as well in lane three. Benarek, outside Lyles, will give him something to really run at around the top bend. Well, Lyle's back in 2018, four years ago, he's only 21 there, ran 19.67 here oh, in no. Zurich. Well, he says, I'm heading for much quicker than that. He's talked about Bolt's world records. He finally has managed to take the American record which stood for so long to Michael Johnson. Men's 200 meters. Hey. A pretty good start. Benarek got out hard and fast as well, but look at Lyles on the top end. Chasing him down, Knighton trying to go with him, and then inside him, Ogando as well. But it's Lyles who will have two metres or so over on the far side. Brown is running well, but Lyles is going away now. Benderek is chasing, but no, Lyles is going to take this in a pretty quick 19.51. That's another meeting record. Well, that was the least he was after, but by anybody's standards, that is very fast indeed. He's setting a new consistent level for himself around the 19.5, 19.6, and when he's really on it, he can run 19.3. Who knows? Maybe he can go quicker as well. I'm pretty sure he will. He thinks he can. Not tonight. Didn't have to. He was much better than anyone else was going to be able to contend with, and that meeting record is certainly one to stack up against any other. 19.52. Brown was trying to hang on for second place with a photo finish for second, third and fourth with Ogando and Benarek and Knighton indeed. Brown's been given it, season's best, 20-0-2. Well done to him, good night's work in the 100 and the 200 metres. Ogando, same time in third place and I suspect Benarek might be just a hundredth or so behind. Well, no, Lyles once again produces, he said, Despite the long season, he still feels fresh. Springy was the word he used yesterday when we were speaking to him. And I wonder if he got what he wanted from the crowd. He laid down a little bit of a challenge, didn't he, as you said. If you give me something, I'll give you something back. He's been working on his start exclusively on the 200 metres, focusing just on that, and he's hoping to take this into the 100 metres next year. Got a good start. Not the best, I have to say. I've seen him out of the blocks quicker. But goodness me, he ran a brilliant bend and really chased down Kenny Benarek very quickly indeed. And then once he was away, it was a question of how low could you go? 1951, 
He's starting to run the 1950s with the same regularity as Shelly Ann Fraser Price is running 10-6 in the 100 metres. There's more to come. And after a long, hard season, you can't complain, Steve, at 1952. Very, very comprehensive victory. Very slight headwind as well. So, you know, he'll point to that and say it would have been 19.1 something, wouldn't it? <laughs> uh, you know, he's, he's an engaging character in a different way to uh, others. Sometimes he's, he's very confident. Uh, he has a great manner about him. He's a, he is an entertainer. We know that. He always has been. And uh, having a bit of fun with the mascot there.